the restoration of a twice over destroyed synagogue in the Jewish quarter of the old city was the newest front for the political battleground over Israel's right to build in East Jerusalem. Despite the Chorva synagogue being located in the middle of the old city's Jewish neighborhood and seemingly unrelated to political dispute, Palestinian leaders cited the restoration as a provocation, and Knesset Speaker Reuven Rivlin and other Israeli leaders used the restoration ceremony as a time to declare Israel's right to build in all of Jerusalem. The Chorva Synagogue, meaning ruined synagogue, was twice destroyed since it was built 300 years ago, once during riots in the 1700s and again in 1948 under Jordanian rule of the old city. Its restoration was celebrated over two days with dancing in the nearby square and a ceremony on Monday night. Prime Minister Netanyahu gave his blessing over a video played on a wall of the synagogue. His message lacked the political fervor of some of the other speakers, perhaps to prevent the escalation of tensions between the Obama administration and his government. Benjamin Spear reporting for the Jerusalem Post, J-Post TV.